Hello everyone, welcome to, um, back to my channel, and I'm gonna do a Minecraft video. Also, I figured out how to record my voice, so um, that's cool. But anyway, yeah, so let's just get started. Okay, so first we need to make a new world. We're gonna call it, uh, uh, There's not enough room. Yeah, we're just gonna call it that. And, um, do norm- Um, I've played Minecraft a lot, so, um, I'm gonna do hard mode. Um, let's see, um, seed, let's do seed, um, uh, hmm. Yeah, that seems like a good enough seed, I guess. No bonus chest. And, um, yeah, let's just get this started. Might, uh, take a little while to load, but, um, while we're at it, Let's, um, I'm just gonna talk about how, um, this series is gonna go. So basically, I'm just gonna play through Minecraft, and, um, if you guys want me to in the comments, you can just type some random thing I have to do if you'd like. Make sure it's logical, not like, I don't know, set your house on fire with lava. I kinda need my house, so I'm nothing too, um, aggressive and all that, but, um, anyway, the, um, World's almost loaded, so... Hmm. I wonder what it's gonna look like. Because I chose the best seed ever. I, I, at least, I don't know. Uh, there we go. Let's see. What does the world of Minecraft bring me? Whoa. Okay, this is a good spawn. What? Okay. This is definitely a great spawn. I'm gonna build my house up there. So, I'm... Um, for all of you who um, may or may not have played Minecraft, most of you would probably know that wood is the first thing you're meant to get. So once you have the wood, you then need to craft it into planks. So yeah, I'm just gonna do some um, chopping at this tree. Also, um, yeah, that's my Minecraft skin. I hope it's, um, good enough. But anyway, so yeah, let's explore a little bit. There we go. Uh, oh, pumpkins. This might be helpful. But I want to figure out how I'm going to get up there. Maybe, um, hmm. Let's see. Is there any, like, villages or anything so I can get some stuff? Because, um, yeah. Uh... Hmm. Um, also, if you, um, if you enjoy my content and would like to see more, um, it'd be perfectly fine if you subscribed. But then again, you don't have to. I'm just doing this for, like, a little fun activity thing for my um, YouTube channel, so... Yeah. Okay, so, um, sticks. And a, um, crafting table. Oh. Ooh, I'm gonna, um... Oh! It's a bee! Hello there. How are you doing? Okay, goodbye. So yeah, um... Crafting table. Boom. Crafting menu. Okay, so, um, we need, um, a sword. And we need a, um, pickaxe. And, um, doors. And, yeah. Wait. Need one of them. There we go. Now, now chopping down trees should go a bit quicker. Uh. Yeah, gonna get some of this. I like birch wood. 
I think it's one of the more better woods out there. But my overall favorite is um spruce. Wish we spawned in like some sort of snow biome, because um I actually had a um a different world. Not during my YouTube channeling, but um during just for fun when before I started this. And um I spawned in a um, snow biome with a big village. I had this big trading operation, I had full enchanted netherite, it was amazing. That was the very first world that I killed the Ender Dragon on. I really like that world, it means a lot. And, um, yeah. So, I reckon we should probably find an area to build a house. I really want to get up there. Hmm. Hmm. Uh... Ooh, a cave. Caves are good places to build houses. Because, um, you've basically just got a pre-built house. All you need to do is just decorate it. Oh. Okay. I don't want to fight that Enderman. I'll have to fight Enderman sooner or later, but not right this second. They're too scary at the moment. So, I'm probably going to build a house here. Let me just, uh, put some locks. Okay, uh, shovel. There we go. Now I can I'm just dig out some dirt. Yay, we got dirt blocks. Dirt blocks, in my opinion, are probably one of the most useful blocks in the game because, for one, there's nothing really interesting you can do with them, so you're able to use them for just building up the places. There's also a bunch of them. So that also makes it kind of... That Enderman's gonna kill me, I know it. This is why I am not very good at giving people eye contact, because whenever I, I see a person, I think Enderman, and I'm just like, well, time to um not look at people. This, this birch wood looks really nice, though. I'm just gonna... Pick up more of this. Haven't seen any sheep yet, so it might be a bit hard to make a bed. So um, yeah, just gonna do some more um, uh, dec decorating ish. Uh, yeah. Hmm. Something that really annoys me about Minecraft is that when you craft a door, it gives you three doors, so I've just got two extra doors. I don't know what I'm going to do with two extra doors. Build this up, because Enderman, being three blocks tall, cannot make eye contact with you over this wall. And Endermen are fast. They're probably one of the scariest Minecraft monsters out there. Well, they're the scariest until the warden comes to town. For all of you who have seen the on Minecraft Live, I cannot wait for that. Because, um, yeah, Minecraft Warden is um, terrifying. So, um, yeah, I'm going to have to use dirt block for my ceiling. It's going to look terrible. Huh? Oh, the Enderman's over there. So, oh. Um. Where is it? Um, if I could kill it, that would be kind of nice, because uh, it's, um, terrifying. But yeah. Normally I'm a bit better at Minecraft, but since this is a, um, uh, I don't know, a, a bit more of a, uh, ooh, squids. But yeah, but anyway, since this is a bit more of an interactive-ish playthrough, like something where I have to talk about, I won't be going through the game as fast as I normally do because this series will be over in about about 10 episodes. And I want it to last a bit longer. I want it to um, be more interesting. Hmm. So yeah, I'm going to make a door here. So looks like I do have a use for um, extra doors. There we go. I've got two doors now. And I can also build up here. This is not my best house I built, but 
It's still good enough. So, um, something that I have learned is that, um, I don't like caves. Like, it's not like I just refuse to go in them, it's more so they're just, um, at the beginning of a world, caves are a, um, problem. Not like a, um, like they're bad or anything. They're just intimidating. They're dark. That's one of the reasons that I am not very good at going into caves in the dark. But then again, I'm pretty sure no one is. Not entirely sure. Anyone out there who's able to explore Minecraft caves without, uh, torches, you have my respect for being a very, very strong-willed person. Cool, I'm a, um, Stone Age now. Gonna make furnaces, I suppose. Oh, wait. Oh, this is perfect. I can make torches. Yes, I need the torches. Uh, uh, uh da, da, da. Torches. Boom. Let there be light in the world. And also let there be dirt blocks. So I can get back up here. See, this is still proving my point for why dirt blocks are amazing. Not trying to sound like a, um, like those what are portrayed to be in Minecraft noobs, how they, um, worship dead bushes and dirt blocks, but, um, yeah, the dirt blocks are kind of helpful. Yeah, just gonna get all this coal. Yeah, there's a lot of coal here. Hmm. Probably gonna get some more stone while I'm at it. Make like some, something like this. Oh, and a sight. Like, don't get me wrong, I am. Um, I like the, um, the andesite and dorit and granite and all that. It just kind of gets in the way is the only problem. There's not really much of a use for it besides building. I've used it in the past, but it'd be cool if you could, um, use it as a substitute for, like, making stone tools and whatever. And maybe, or, oh, here's an idea. Um, it might be very difficult to implement, but you should be able to, um, use andesite and granite and dorit and all that. To make it their own exclusive stone tools. Like, they're still stone tools, but they're, um, they got extra boosts. Like, maybe Andesite has extra durability and Granite has extra mining speed. And there's, like, um, just different trade offs. I'd really like that. So, um, yeah. Minecraft has been a very, very, um, big part of my life. So, um, I'm really happy that I'm finally getting around to starting this series. Oh, it's really dark in my house. I need, uh... Oh, wait. Is it nighttime? Oh, no. Um. My torch is low. There we go. I did not expect it to become nighttime this quickly. Let me make this. And, uh, a that, and maybe a sword. We need to make... Yeah, 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 this is going well. This is totally going well. So, yes, furnaces. Oh, no. I don't have any food. Yeah, I don't have any food. What am I going to do? I, ca I can't just... You know what? That's it. I'm done being scared of the dark and all that. I'm going to, um... Yep, you heard me right. I'm gonna um, get this. There we go. Okay, that's all I'm doing. Wait, but there's this side as well. Um, would be really funny. Oh. Ooh. Hello there, Zambi. You're totally. You're kind of loud, Mr. Zambi. I respect that you- I respect that you're able to talk loudly. Oh, there's a skelly. Hey, skelly. Hey, shoot at me. Hey, hey. Trick ya. You're not gonna get any shots on me. 
You ain't gonna get any shots on me. Um, well, this is quite the situation. I've got no food. I am um, no crossbow. I am very good with crossbows, but anyway, I got no no chest, so my inventory is limited. However, I do have this. This here is the fabled and legendary nacho cheese. Now, for all of you who haven't played Minecraft, the nacho cheese right here is um one of the most rare and powerfulest items in the whole game. Because what it does, it um it can color things. Now, you may be thinking, Emerald Diggy, that's just like the standard dyes and whatnot. Well, nope. This one, it colors it the color of cheese, which is yellow. And yellow, in my opinion, is one of the more underrated colors. It's, I don't know why, but I feel like that yellow is just a very unappreciated color because of, it's the color of the sun. Well, actually... It's kind of the color of the sun. It's the, um, color of, um, gold. Color of, um, uh, mustard. It's just the color of all... Oh. Ooh. This is a ravine right here. Ravines are, um... Just, uh... Yeah. Yeah, it's a ravine. Wow. Got myself set for life with mining now. Uh, at the very edge of it. Let's see what's else is over here. Oh, that's a drop. Don't want to die on the first episode. That wouldn't be very. Actually, it would be kind of funny content, but I just really don't want to die on the first episode. It'd be kind of an embarrassing moment. But then I can. I suppose someone could make a funny perfectly cut scream or something, because I might freak out. Okay, so, what I find to be the most unique and just just great about Minecraft is the, um, the core mechanics, just the, the art style of being strictly made of blocks and blocks only. I just wish that there was more games that had this captivating magic that Minecraft has. I don't know what I should call it, but it's there. It's definitely there. The um, the magic of Minecraft. So um, yeah, I'm um, is it daytime yet? Nope, it's still nighttime. Quiet, would you, Mr. Zombie? Ah. I can't get along with that guy if I tried. I'm gonna, um... I know, I'm gonna just smelt some stone. I'm gonna make a, um... Blast furnace, I think. Do you, How do you make a blast furnace? Uh... There's no blast furnace. Um... Wait, is it turning daytime? Those blocks look brighter. Definitely turning daytime or something. Um. Uh. So, um. Anyone who is, um, interested in wanting to continue the series, be sure to, um, uh, like the video. And, um. Yeah, just comment down below what kind of random things you'd like to see me do, like, um building or um um exploring just anything i think that um this is a um a, a not very um pleasant situation but i think it's still a good place to end the video so i'll remember this as my um first house is that noise Uh, the furnaces. So yeah, I remember this is my first house of the series, and, um, everyone who enjoyed this series, um, and wants to see it grow, be sure to, um, yeah, just, um, 
tell everyone about this. And, um, yeah. That's it for now. Um, yeah. Uh, Emerald Diggy, signing off. Goodbye, world. Uh,